somebody may have found the secret to staying young. It's a type of exercise called interval training, and scientists say it may have anti-aging benefits for older adults. This is uh, this good news to hear. It's huh? good news, yeah. So you know, it's it's important to say that they, in this study, two age groups participated: 18 to 30 okay. and 65 to 80 years of age. So everyone took part in either high-intensity interval training or resistance training or a combination of both. After three months, the researchers found that interval training was useful in reversing the older participants' mitochondria. So Ooh. mitochondria are considered, uh, Joanne, the power generators of your cells. Older adults saw a 69% increase in mitochondrial capacity and younger participants had a 49% increase. So it's just really amazing stuff. Interval training is when you like go hard and then easy and hard that's, like that. That's exactly right? right. How does it make us younger? It's a good question. So think <laughs> of the mon mitochondria as these tiny little batteries, right? Okay. As we get older, the energy producing mitochondria for yourself naturally become less efficient. So researchers reported changes in the mitochondria where older adult cells really resembled younger people's cells when looking at how they handle energy. So that's how it does it. It makes sense. Can anyone do it though? Because it can be stressful to do that type of training. Absolutely. So high, in high interval, inter high intensity interval training training sounds intimidating but you don't have to be an athlete to do it so all you need to do is alternate like you said short bursts of intense aerobic exercise with intervals of lighter moderate exercise so if you're interested in participating here at my prescription so first of all if you're a beginner start off slowly yes. by alternating uh, walking with spurts of fast walking for 30 seconds at a time building up to three minutes for each also you can use interval training for any cardio workout like running or jumping rope just remember to have a warm-up exercise to loosen up your joints also be careful of injuries. Don't rush into working out too hard before your body is really ready. And lastly, interval training may, be, may not be good if you have joint or muscle problems. So talk to your doctor if you have any of those health conditions, but this could really be a game changer for us. Well, I guess. Gotta start it. Dr. You can Nandy. do it tonight. Yeah, I will. Well, tomorrow morning. How's okay. that? All right. Thank you, Stephen.